Hello, welcome to Movie Studio, had a major cliffhanger at the end. According to an Outline of Season 7 update, the story will cover a lot of ground. The seventh season of Outlander, which only had eight episodes, was based on Diana Gavaldon's best-selling book series and covered a lot of her novel, A Breath of Snow. Outlander Season 7 will now incorporate the novel's remaining chapters and Gavaldon's seventh book, An Echo in the Bone. As a result, viewers should prepare for an exciting journey. The standoff that Claire and Jamie had with Richard Brown and the safety committee resulted in a significant gunfight and a witch hunt against Claire in the season 6 finale of Outlander. Because she has few other options, Claire agrees to stand trial, and Tom Christie appears as her mysterious guardian when she and Jamie split up on the way. Brianna and Roger, on the other hand, travel to Roger's seminary school, where they discover that Jimmy has a birthmark that indicates Roger is Jimmy's real father. The Outlander season 6 finale had a lot going on, but fans of Diana Gabaldon's books will know that the things that didn't happen are much more interesting. The fact that the seventh season of Outlander will be divided into two halves is the most significant update. Due to a production hold during the epidemic, Outlander's most recent season only had eight episodes. As a result, the coming season will be longer. It won't be available on Stars for more than 16 weeks, which is good news. Instead, the first eight episodes of the show will air before taking a break to air the next AIDS in 2024. The network has begun to release sneak peeks of the upcoming Outlander season in preparation for its Stars premiere. Initially, the previews were shown off at the ATX Festival. One will surely whet the appetite of fans of the well-known duo because it features Jamie and Claire discussing their goals for the future and past. The new Outlander season 7 footage that Stars releases will be available on the show's social media pages and the network's YouTube channel. Is Outlander going to end with the 7th season? Let's look at it. The popular Stars drama Outlander will continue after season 7. Outlander's 8th and final season has been renewed by Stars for a second season. There are 11 books in the Outlander series, so there is enough material for the show to cover. The events of the novel and Echo in the Burn are to be covered in Season 7, but there are at least four other novels that could provide information for the season. The only thing that has been revealed about Outlander's 8th season is that actress Katrina Barf will direct an episode. Due to the fact that Jamie's parents will be the focus of a spin-off series called Outlander Blood of My Blood, Outlander fans may not have to say goodbye to the show's intriguing setting for very long. The books in the Diana Gabaldon series serve as the basis for each season of Outlander. Despite this, authors have continued to deviate from the main plot points, such as keeping Mudoff alive after Kool-Aidon and incorporating elements from previous books into the current book season's timeline, like they did with Wendigo and Bonnet. In the seventh season, will the writers revisit this and incorporate elements from written in My Heart's Own Blood? They might do so to add to the story of the Hunter family, move the events of the Revolutionary War forward, or give Brianna and Roger's time-traveling adventures more room. The first, four stars. Both Katrina Balfi and Sam Hewen will reprise their roles as Jamie and Claire Fraser. Richard Rankin plays Roger McKenzie once more, and Sophie Skelton plays Brianna McKenzie once more. Kristen Afeton takes on the role of Jamie's sister, Jenny Marie, in the seventh season updates of Outlander. Laura Donnelly was originally cast to play Jenny, but her time on the show was cut short due to scheduling issues. Graham McTavish plays Dougal McKenzie once more, and Nell Hudson plays Larry Fraser. Stephen Cree plays Ian Murray's dad Lottie Verbeek, plays Gillis Duncan, Andrew Witt plays Brian Fraser, and Layla Copies plays Joan McKimmy. Charles Vandevart also plays William Ransom, Jamie's grown son. Caitlin O'Rean, David Barry, Lauren D, Lyle, John Bell, and Keezer Donboy are all back. Outlander. According to season 7 updates, Gabaldon's 6th book and a portion of her 7th will be told in the next season. Outlander's time traveler Wendy Godonna returns in a breath of snow and ashes, as does the terrible fire that brought Brianna back in time in the first place. The fact that Claire will most likely be tried for the murder of Malva in season 7 of Outlander will help to explain why Tom Christie is protecting her. The birth of Brian, Roger's daughter Amanda, is a plot point because Brianna is currently pregnant. Amanda's heart condition will very likely power Bray and Roger to return back so as to save her. In Gabaldon's Echo in the Bone, multiple timelines follow Brianna and Roger as they settle in Lalabrock today and Claire and Jamie in the past as they visit Jenny and Ian in Scotland. Intriguingly, Outlander Season 7 will feature a significant role for Jamie's son William Ransom, Earl of Ellesmere at the age of 19, as well as larger roles for Lord John, Fergus and Marsali. The American Revolutionary War finally gets underway on Outlander, enhancing the action's drama. This season, will Amanda be healthy when she is born? Roger and Brianna were put on the back burner. Brianna attempts to utilize her technical skills once more in the beginning, but she is ignored. Roger considers the pulpit's increasing appeal. When Brianna and Roger learn that she is expecting their second child, she receives little attention. Her growing baby bump should be seen getting more screen time this season. In the books, a girl named Amanda is born to Brianna, and Amanda has a significant birth defect. Will the series feature Amanda with this flow, necessitating additional time travel in the hope of curing her condition? Given that Diana Gabaldon, a prolific author, wrote the series' original material and has gladly contributed to the drama's production whenever necessary since its inception, it stands to reason that she would add to the script at some point. Gabaldon wrote the 11th episode of Outlander Season 5, and in April 2022, she confirmed on Twitter that she wrote the 9th episode of Outlander Season 6 because that season was cut short. A portion of what she wrote for it has now been turned into what will eventually air in Season 7.
In December 2022, Stars released a teaser trailer. However, in May 2023, a brand new trailer was released. Stars will renew Outlander Season 7 in March 2021. Even though the season is billed as supersized, Outlander's seventh season will only be the show's second with 16 episodes. The first was the 2014 premiere of Outlander. Stars announced on April 6, 2022, that Outlander Season 7 had begun filming. In related Outlander Season 7 news, actor Sam Hewen, who portrays Jamie Fraser, released photographs from the set. Another piece of evidence came from social media when Diana Gabaldon announced that the new season would be set in the United States, London, Canada, and Scotland, but that most of the production would take place in Scotland, as is the program's custom. On June 16, 2023, the brand new season will be available. The American Revolution plays a significant role in the seventh season of Outlander, as the new trailer demonstrates. Jamie is one of several people who are persuaded to pick a side in the conflict between England and the new United States of America. As the trailer alternates between Claire possibly being hanged and me in uniform ready for the fight, it also emphasizes Claire's predicament. Drama abounds in Outlander's seventh season. The second episode of Outlander 7 is expected to air in 2024, but no date has been announced. For the time being, that is all there is to it. Make sure you enjoy our video, please. Please use the comment section to voice your opinions and thoughts. Make sure to hit the bell icon to never miss an update, and subscribe to the channel to keep up with the latest news and reviews about our upcoming films. We appreciate your attention to this video. We look forward to seeing you at the next one. Peace in the meantime.